listening to you yet again. No, what I was asking you was, what are the business B2B sectors you cater to? Who are your major clients there? So in B2B, we have like uh, many verticals uh, that we are uh, doing business with. For example, we have the auto components, pharmaceuticals, engineering goods, textiles, retail. So all of these businesses, all of these verticals, uh, in terms of transportation. I think the moreover, we were not really affected by the demonetization. So it was uh, 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 looking at the other logistics co uh, companies, which took a big hit. We were really uh, uh, not affected, and we had a 14% of that, that month also. So uh, in, in, in sense, uh, none of the uh, businesses that we were working with, the companies that we were working with, were also getting affected. Uh, perfect. So. Agarwal, uh, actually the line is a bit scratchy, so let me try once again. Uh, you did mention to us the last time we spoke that in the second half of the year you expect about a 15 to 18% revenue growth. But what about FY18? What are the initial uh, trends indicating and what kind of sustainable revenue growth do you see for the business? Right. Uh, in FY18, definitely uh, we're looking at about 8 to 20% growth. Uh, there, there was a shortfall in this year's target. Only because of the uh, the changes that happened. Uh, at the peak. Uh, Mr. Gawal, this is not working at all. Uh, we will uh, try and touch base with you uh, yet again.